This is Ralph with 13 Peppers and today we are going to try ourselves the C22 Stinger. Now when I open this up and cut this open, I just had an overwhelming whiff and aroma of a super hot pepper. If you ever cut open a super hot pepper, it has a very, very distinct smell and everything to it. And that was just kind of overwhelming, which has me scared. Um, <laughs> the other thing is, is when I was trying to look up the Scoville scale, the Scoville scale just varied. Um, <clears throat> one of the websites where I kind of got my information are from that I like, which is HRC Company, they actually said that the Scoville skill was anywhere on the pods because it was still kind of unstable from 875,000 Scoville up to 1.75 million Scoville. So that is a huge range. So either I'm just going to be hurting a little bit or I'm going to be dying. So. <laughs> And one other thing too, there is a few chili heads out there that have no problem eating these things and my hat's off to you. Um, some of the people I talk to that eat these things along with I do, we question ourselves on our mental state on <laughs> why we actually eat these, but <laughs> I don't know, we're glutton for punishment, but okay, time to stop stalling and let's give this a taste. Why do I have to have the floral taste? I don't like the floral taste. As of right now, chewed it, <clears throat> everything's out, and you got to say slow, like building. I can feel it building. It is in the um, <clears throat> back of my tongue, um, going towards the, up through the roof of my mouth, up towards the front, so, and starting to grow around my tongue. Very, very slow on the heat buildup, but it is still ramping. Let's see where it gets to. I don't know what the time is at this point because I don't watch time, but <clears throat> this thing is still burning and oh my God. This is very intense, back of the throat, back of the tongue. That's where it's kind of concentrating. Starting to move down the throat just a little bit. But oh, wow. I don't think I've eaten anything that's actually built up that slowly and still going. Wow. <clears throat> Peak is coming down now. Uh, Eyes watering. Tongue still burning. Not as much. Probably say I'm about 80. So hopefully, and, but it's dropping here. 80%. Um, <sighs> that had probably the slowest build I have ever had in a super hot pepper. And the way it actually came up in the roof from the back, all the way up to the front, and then it slowly crept back in the back, getting <clears throat> a little bit easier to talk and everything else like that too. So, wow, that was a hot pepper. Now, me rating super hot, when you get up to 1.2, 1.3, 1.4 million or above, which, whew, uh, whew, excuse me, that was rude, I apologize. But once you start getting to above those numbers, it's very hard to tell exactly what the heat level is. It's just hot. This was hot. Um, 
Yeah, I would probably say, uh, and I'm guessing, because the Scoville scale is so subjective, but I would probably say this one is in the range between 1.3 and 1.6, right around there. So very, very hot and had a, such an interesting build on that. Wow. That was actually interesting and amazing. I survived. So as of right now, I'd probably say heat level is about 50% of what it was before. So top of the tongue, especially towards the back, um, still burning. Because like I said, the burn just kind of slowly crept to the front and then it slowly crept back to the back. Weird, so, but very nice. <laughs> Whew. Yeah, my wife says I am freaking crazy for doing some of this stuff, but hey, for some reason, I enjoy it. But, <laughs> but with that, if you enjoyed what you've seen here today, please subscribe to the channel. I would greatly appreciate it. And with that, I want to say, <laughs> still trying to get my breath here just a little bit, but hey. <laughs> but once again, thank you all for watching the video, and you all have a very, very good day. Wow, that was hot. <laughs>